a reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. Luke. Jesus told his disciples a parable about the necessity for them to pray always without becoming weary. He said, There was a judge in a certain town who neither feared God nor respected any human being. And a widow in that town used to come to him and say, Render a just decision for me against my adversary. For a long time the judge was unwilling, but eventually he thought, While it is true that I neither fear God nor respect any human being, because this widow keeps bothering me, I shall deliver a just decision for her lest she finally come and strike me. The Lord said, Pay attention to what the dishonest judge says. Will not God then secure the rights of his chosen ones who call out to him day and night? Will he be slow to answer them? I tell you, he will see to it that justice is done for them speedily. But when the Son of Man comes, will he find faith on earth? The Gospel of the Lord a judge, a widow. The parable of the persistent widow is unusually explicit in describing the judge. He neither fears God nor respects any human being. In effect, the man is not religious and is incapable of shame. This unscrupulous character, however, meets his match in a rare character, a widow who, far from being timid and helpless, keeps on coming to him, asking for a just decision against her adversary. Because she gives him so much trouble, the judge finally acquiesces, lest she finally come and strike me. The literal rendering of the Greek is, lest she end up giving me a black eye. This means damage to his reputation. Although the judge has no regard for humans, he has to depend on some sort of reputation to continue in his office as judge. Otherwise, he will be removed. Jesus tells this parable so that his disciples may pray always without becoming weary. The comparison which moves from the lesser character to the greater has a crystal clear lesson. If the dishonest judge is able to give justice, how much more speedily will God respond to the petitions of his elect? But there is a twist on the assurance. God's mercy and succor are not in doubt, but are there any widows among the listeners who cry out to God day and night? Will the Son of Man find faith? on the earth